Well, 2020 was a tough season for all high school football teams due to COVID, but it was particularly difficult for Gordo, which due to a sinkhole had to play all of its home games at nearby Pickens County High School in reform. It didn't hurt the Green Wave, though, as they reached the Class 4A state championship game. Still, Gordo is looking forward to playing this season on a brand new turf field. Tatum Vaught has the story. The Gordo High School football team kicks off their home opener next Friday against the Oakman Wildcats in hopes to repeat another impressive season. But there will be one thing different about this season. They'll be back on their home turf. We, we've had some uh, drainage issues for quite a while, but you know, and, and that was one of the things that we wanted to be able to fix. And uh, you know, it, it took a, a group effort to do that, no doubt. The community began the renovation project following the 2019 season. Brand new turf and resurfaced asphalt are just some of the renovations made around the stadium. But the community focused on finishing the final touches so they'd be ready for kickoff next week. You know, we wanted to have the best place we could possibly have for our, uh, our students. That's what it's all about as the kids and, and you know, to represent our communities in the right way. Just to be able to, to come out here on Libby Hankins Field in front of a home crowd is, is going to be a special feeling. So it won't be a little bit a touch emotional. Gordo has always had a good support, good following, no matter where we play, if it's at home or away. Uh, our community is great in supporting all of our athletics. With these brand new renovations and an all-star roster, the Green Wave is going to be hard to beat this season. It looks like they've already gotten a win by just being back home. Reporting from Gordo High School, Tatum Vaught, WVUA 23 Sports.